what's going on YouTube how are you doing today today I am going to bring you a tour of this 2021 that's here at SPD some new trucks went out for company drivers this is the LT International now this trucks not fully equipped yet but close it does not have the APU on it yet It's got the 22.5s tires, pretty standard. It's a good looking truck for an international. It does have the uh, satellite up there. I still have to put the headache rack on the back of it. The APU, some grease on that fifth wheel. And then they've also got to put the uh, toolbox on right here. It out. All right. Someone's going to get a nice truck here. We'll jump inside and get the inside of it as well. Get a good frontal picture of it. It's got the fog lights. All right, let's go inside and see what this thing looks like on the inside. So I open the door and the first thing I see is this uh, door. It's got, yeah, it looks pretty nice opening the door. The seat has a lot of lumbar support, which is really nice. We'll go ahead and climb up in here and get a look at the dash. All right, so this truck uh, appears to be a 13 speed. It has the new Trimble E-Logs. It's got an extra gauge package. Well, actually they just moved the gauges over here from the dash. Little cubby hole right here and right there. You have your steering wheel controls. And then there's the dash. You also have your uh, button here to check your lights, your work light, your headlights are over here. And then they've got the radio, trailer brake, auxiliaries and everything else that you might need. Your differential locks, off-road. And then you also have your cubby hole here, which I used to, I, I've driven a um, international before in the past. And I've gotta say that this is a lot better than what they used to be. Now, you have wraparound storage, which is nice. This is where your CB will go. There's a uh, cubby hole here with a drawer spacer thing that comes out. And we'll go back here. There's the satellite DVR that the company uh, provides, TV. Um, satellite coverage. This cubby hole opens up. You put a lot of stuff in there. Now this one is a top bunk or double bunk. I mean, um, you got the big windows. You have your power outlets right there. Actual wall plugs, and then underneath the TV. There is a refrigerator. There is a actual freezer in here. If I can get it open, I'll show you guys. It's not massive or anything, but um, it's still nice to have. And it's really nice to have a company that will provide this stuff for you. Um, Not sure how that comes out, but 
That's a door drawer or a tabletop that comes out that you can use. Um, a lot of freight liners I have them. On this side, we have another cabinet there. A step. Um, you can put your microwave right there. And then you've got this compartment. It's actually pretty deep. Um, hopefully, hopefully you guys can see that. Overall, I'm impressed. Uh, the interior of this truck really reminds me of the, uh, what is it, the Lone Star that they have. But overall, really nice. You can see, uh, this is the passenger side. You can see the wall plugs right there. That's also on the other side of the truck. And then when the APU is installed, you'll also have some more um, wall plugs, probably, more than likely. But this is what the International looks like on the inside. Um, like I said, I, I'm impressed by International. I think they've really stepped their game up as far as what the interior looks. Let's see what we got right here. Oh. We will not mess with that. Well done, in, uh, International. But alright guys, if you like this video, hit that like, share, and subscribe button, and I will see you on the next episode. This is a 2021 International LT. Really nice truck.